Everything you require to lead a happy life has been provided for you. It is now up to you to take action. God wants to provide for all of your needs to help you be successful and happy in life. He wants you to lead a full life that is meaningful, fulfilling and purposeful. However, there are times when we encounter obstacles or trying circumstances in our lives and we wonder if God has a different plan for us than what we have already initiated. We don't whether God truly loves us to the extent that he claims to dear children you have more than enough. Life to live do not be afraid of it. God is always with you so do not be afraid of dying. In any case this individual feels that the greatest approach to communicate with you at the moment is to write out their feelings on paper. They've remained silent out of hesitation, but don't think that means they're not confident. God has already taken care of everything. Therefore, there is no need to be afraid of anything in this world. Your Lord, I'm saying to you today, I have caused many issues trying to take on your role and fix issues and situations that were not mine to fix. I've also caused issues by not addressing things when I should have. Please guide me and show me what is my responsibility and what is yours. Give me the wisdom to know what to address and what to pray and love people through. Don't let me hold on to something I need to let go of and don't let me throw away something I need. I don't want to create messes that require miracles to fix solo you are loved without conditions by the one who created you. You have a purpose and a plan, a destiny. You are meant to fulfill that is ordained by God himself. God has never left our side and never will. When you believe in the name of Jesus, you are both redeemed and forgiven. You are no accident, nor are you the sum of your past mistakes. God brought himself to earth to live and die for you. You are loved. God wants you to know you're not reading this by accident. Everything is going to be okay. Take a deep breath and remember that you've been in worse places before. You've been uncomfortable, anxious and scared, but you survived. Close your eyes and hear my voice saying, To you I'm making a way. Be still and know that I am God. Whoever believes in the Son has eternal life. Whoever does not obey the Son shall not see life but the wrath of God remains on him. You won't believe how much a single letter will affect your life in the upcoming months. Try not to undervalue your significance in the big picture. I appreciate your curiosity about God. I am God who created everything. I want to discuss how I may be of assistance to you since I love you. I wish to talk about the things that evaded me personally and what I am aware is effective for other people. Just like everyone else you have unique qualities, even if it can be challenging. You have a reason for being here, asking for assistance from someone who has more knowledge than you won't do any harm. Typed yes if you believe in God. Bless you.